my diagnostic journey is unusual. I didn't have any symptoms. I was trying to actually change life insurance companies. And we found that my blood test results, you know, because of my age, they did some tests. They were out of whack. So that started a journey which took about four years. You know, I did, but I didn't recognize them. You know, because we're all different. When I was a kid, I could never do a sit-up. I thought, well, you know, you just need to get some exercise. But of course, now I know that's not what it was. Um, I know when I, when I did things like sports, I get tired faster than, than other kids would. Uh, there, were, there were clues, but I just thought I was normal. I didn't really, didn't really see anything. So when I was diagnosed, I was active. And I was going to the gym a couple of times a week. I was doing sports, you know, everything was actually quite good. And then what, what seems to be typical with a lot of patients is we get to a certain point and then it's almost like falling off a cliff. So my symptoms really started to progress. My breathing got a lot worse. I had very poor quality of sleep, tired all the time, um, was, was getting pretty bad. So that's when we decided that we should, we should get me treated. The treatment for Pompe disease is myozyme, which is a bi-weekly infusion. So the patient either goes into the hospital or maybe gets home infusions every two weeks. It takes about four or five hours, so not, not too bad, half a day. Um, w when I started my treatment, my health was actually getting much, much worse. My breathing capacity sitting up was half what it should be. Lying down, it was about a quarter. So my my health was, was getting pretty poor once i started the treatment the progression stopped i actually improved significantly where my my uh, lung capacity went from 50 percent up to well over 70 percent so i'm unusual that i improved that much most patients maybe see a little bit of improvement but it really just stops the progression myozyme myozyme is a life-saving treatment for infantile Pompe patients. Infantile patients usually pass away from the disease by the time they're about a year old. So it's a very, very serious disorder for, for, for the infants. It tends to affect their organs where, as with late onset, we don't tend to have organ involvement, it's more just muscles. So it's a, it's a very fatal disease for infants. And myozyme is a life-saving treatment for them.